the war to end all wars. That's what I read on the World War I poster at the Veterans Home, where we go to bring encouragement and appreciation to those who served. Each of the veterans of World War II that I interviewed had determined that the cause of peace was worth giving their lives for. So we call them the greatest generation. But what if we were willing to fight for peace today? How would we do it? With one army overpowering another? Or by fighting with ideas, ideas of tolerance and respect for other people and their ways. Peace brings more peace. Fighting brings more fighting. We have much more to gain by focusing on shared values that bring us closer together. Values like life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. These are the golden values that every generation has longed for, but sometimes the efforts to achieve them were only offered for their own kind. What if we work together to achieve these golden values for others, even as we fight for them for ourselves? Then humankind could be a true brotherhood without regard for boundaries, cultures, or races. I can imagine a day when racial and national prejudice is as foreign and unacceptable as slavery is today. Remember, that once was the accepted norm. But to achieve this, we will need to encourage enough people to change their priorities and values so we can act together and be a powerful force for change. And I'm so thankful to be part of this great example of how technology can be used to bring us all closer together in ideas and goals, a step closer to world peace. And with this thought, I'd like to introduce a song my sister is going to sing. Maybe I, maybe you can bring a change to the world. Thank you, Arthur. And yes, I'd like to dedicate this song to all of you who are promoting actions for peace around the world.
thank you.